When was that? Uh? Then this is peach. When was it? The fight? November 27, uh, 2005. Huh? When was the fighting? Um, Between the two Roborowski. Yeah, about the time. Uh. A few months, uh, that means uh, after that we separated them, then you notice that it started to become smaller. So after you separated them? Seems uh, to be after the fight, then you can open this. And when do you say the fight was again? Uh, uh, on the top only. Two, three months ago. Two, three months ago. Yes. Was it roughly the same time Ichinas started? Ichinas, I think they're always scratching, uh, but uh, after the fight, then uh, one or two weeks later, it started to seem to have losing weight or become smaller. Okay, mm -hmm. how's the appetite? Appetite. Maybe two. Appetite. Still eating, uh, uh, but uh, usually they don't finish the bowl. Uh. Okay. Uh, uh, change daily, they'll just remove the fresh one, uh, old, uh, old one, and give them a fresh one. So it's a picky, picky eater, is it? Mm. Is it less recently? It seems to be, uh, yeah. So decrease, huh? How are the stools, huh? Stools are something tight. Yes, yes. You can have a look a bit. Yeah. Uh. The yes. stools are quite solid, uh, yeah. but not many, uh, right? Okay, what food are you feeding? Uh? Sunflower seeds. Mixture, uh, it's a... It's a commercial mix? Yeah, correct. Any change recently? No, still the same. Can you put here, not? it runs away. Do you away. use any sandbar? Say again? Do you use any sandbar? Ah, uh, yes. I mm. can uh, put here, put here to wave first. You know what, I think it may run. It runs away, not? It will run, huh? You will, you will. Yeah. So? I'll just weigh him now. I'll weigh him. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hmm? Just need to know the weight. Yeah. He run off, yeah. It's wet because we just applied the. Yeah, I'm going to get. Can I invite? Go and get. Hmm? No, okay, don't weigh that. Oh, yeah, hop off. Uh. You, will, you will jump off, uh. that's the problem. Oh, Rossi's are very fast. Uh. Fastest hamster in the world. Man. It's wet because of what? Uh? Oh, I applied medicine. Uh, what medicine? This spray. Yeah, I'll go get for you. From so the pet shop, one, uh? Yeah. For skin disease. Uh. Okay, where do you say it's Minch? Where is it? Say where, where do you think that it's Minch? Actually, we're not very sure. It's what the consultants say. Usually, they say uh, the underside first. It's golden. Which one is the pet shop? And then the tail, you can see that the tail uh, is no longer bushy, but the, the hair is yeah, lost. Cool, the pet shop on the sun, so the ah, pet shop one. Okay, so there are a few things that we need to consider. Okay, first one is um, skin disease, only got a few things. First one is allergies. Okay, so we try to figure out whether anything was changed in the last three months. Start okay. The second thing we want to know, like what you say, is to be mange. Okay, that one, uh, we call it insects that bite on the skin. Okay, usually we see patches of hair loss. Okay, and the it's very itchy. Okay, the last one we worry about is contact problems. Means that the cage is either not hygienic, okay, not clean as often, uh, some irritation to the the skin due to um, let's say for example bleach or whatever they're using to clean the cage. Okay, then what happens is you see a bit of uh, patches of hair loss. Okay, for this fella, okay, uh, from what I can see, okay, the skin is still fairly pink. It's not red, doesn't have a lot of rashes. Okay, uh, hair loss wise, it doesn't seem to have a lot of hair loss. Okay, oh, it used to be very fluffy. Eh? Yeah, um, so, so what happens is um, the, the hair is thinning. Mm. Okay, but it's not really one patch of gone, one patch of gone, one patch of gone. That's the usual symptoms of uh, insect bite, yeah? Uh, not really. Yeah. Okay, so insect bites. What you would, what, what you will notice is you will see dots uh, Okay, like normal we all gonna bite. So mm -hmm. you see little red spots. That one is. Don't see it, yeah. We don't see it as of yet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, that being said, treatment we can still treat. Okay, usually for these skin problems, what we'll do is we'll give the anti mite anyway. Okay, we'll give an anti itch and we we'll give some antibiotics. Okay. Um, I need you to go home and see what is causing the itchiness okay and also uh, if let's say the hair is thinning uh, it could be due to either the sand bar or not enough nutrition uh. so the nutrition not enough the hair cannot grow into very bushy uh. okay mm -hmm. so that's why i need to know if let's say the food was changed etc because the other one is the same uh, no the other one is okay still mm -hmm. so you can use that as a gauge uh. 
uh, difficult individuals. So they may have different emotions. Correct, correct. I mean, same as kids. Uh. So the thing is, um, you have to understand that each hamster is different. Okay, so this hamster could be more sensitive to certain things. Mm. Okay, but no worries. Uh, we will tr- we will protect from binge anyway. Mm. Okay, we we'll give antibiotic. We we'll give anti H. Okay, I need you to show me the spray. <coughs> After the you started this, the consultant advice that uh, once uh, they. Oh, you already giving this uh, so I don't need to give ready uh. This one use when you start. Uh, three days ago. Eh? Why is it improving? Is it improving? I'm not sure. No. Uh-huh. Oh, because this one was already is already an insecticide. Mm. So this one already will, will treat for your main tree. Mm. Okay, and if it's not improving, that means that's not the problem. You understand what I mean? Okay, so what I need from you is uh, do you have a picture of the cage at home? Or the, where does where does he usually? It's a, it's a, like a okay. fish tank. Fish tank. Plastic tank. Plastic kind, huh? Do you mm. use any detergent to wash it? I use a spray. What? The spray recommended by them, uh, that will uh, like a disinfectant. Ah, uh, what, what, what is uh, is that something new in the last three, four weeks? No, three, it's the, three, four the only months? thing that has changed is the bedding. I changed the bedding because the usual one I bought is no longer. Uh, when no was that? Huh? Before, or after before. Uh, before oh. I think, before the fight. If I'm not Okay, the, the issue is now we are already trying to figure out what's the difference between now and five months ago. Because five months ago you said it was okay. Mm. Okay, so I just need you f- to confirm that the food has not been changed. The bathing, okay, we will change back to the old one. Mm-hmm. Okay, and then uh, other factors that cause skin itchiness, uh, we need to remove. Uh. Mm-hmm. Huh? So have you changed the location where the cage is at? So? Uh, no, it's still the same cage. Oh, the alone. same uh, alone. Uh. Okay, can. So what what I recommend for you is this one. Since you already bought the spray, then you continue the spray. Okay, I give some antibiotics, anti itch. Okay, you have to feed. Okay, it's oral oral medication. So it's uh, through the it's a drinking syringe. water. Uh-huh. You must put in the mouth. Oh. I can show you how to do it, but you need a glove like, if you're worried that the fella run away or fella bite you. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I need you to go home and look at the cage, see what is the problem. Okay. If you think that it's because of the bedding, we swap to the old one when there was no problem. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, other things, so if food all this, we need to stabilize. Okay. We just want to rule out allergies. Okay. Because it can also cause skin itchiness. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's lower part, more. That's it, lower part, scratching. Yeah. Yeah, more of the itchiness below. Mm. So it could be the bedding. Oh? Mm, okay.